welcome to another episode of the Hammered Ham. And today I'm running a homebrew 6DQ6 CW transmitter. Let me send you something. You may think, what is that? Some random dits? Maybe I'm sending you a greetings. Like, hi. Or maybe I'm laughing at you through Morse code. On with the video. So here she is. The beautiful homebrew 6DQ6 CW transmitter. Two bands, 40, 80 meter, crystal controlled. Here's my key. Transmit switch. Take a look around the back, see how she's built. So here's the back side of her. There's the 6DQ6 output tube, voltage regulator, 5E4 rectum fire, power transformer and a choke, and the meteoroid, some coils, this and that and the other thing. Now, if you want to build one of these, all the information is on the web on w5dxs.tripod. Com. A very slick little circuit utilizing one tube for the oscillator and output. Very cool design. Here's the bottom side. You can see the wiring is very straightforward. This guy added a relay to switch the antenna and provide 120 volts output to this octo socket for a TR switch. But all in all, very clean, a very nice transmitter. Something you could build and have some fun with. So I've got it hooked up into a Drake W4 watt meter and then to a dummy load. So you see what we got for output. So you can see we're drawing about, say, 75 milliamps. About 20 watts. And we're listening on a National 303 receiver. What a great, simple homebrew transmitter that you can build yourself. The information is on the web for free. And then all you have to do is team it up with a nice receiver, like perhaps a Hammerland. Get on CW. We'll meet up on 40 meters. Hope to see you there. 73s from N6. TLU, the Hammered Ham. See ya.